You've likely seen this video of the moment when Patrick Mahomes handed his game-worn headband to young fans following the big playoff win over the Colts. Yeah, he's pretty pumped up. <laughs> KCTV5's Emily Rittman has the rest of the story now about how two friends made a memory that will last a long time. Brody Vaughn had quite the show and tell to share with his classmates this Monday morning, and it was filled with a little Mahomes magic. There's a buzz inside the hallways of Clardy Elementary School. When I told everyone, they were like, I don't believe you. And then I go to my backpack and I show them it, and they're like, what? What? Two friends have a tale to tell about their Saturday at Arrowhead. Christy Kofer's fourth grade classroom couldn't wait to hear it again. Yeah, tell us again. Yeah. <laughs> tell us again, Brody. Aww. Thanks to Charlie Pringer's grandma, he and a friend Brody got to take selfies with Kelsey, hang with Charkandrick West and Justin Houston. They also high five Tyreek Hill. This moment was the moment when they saw number 15 enter the locker room club. So I was kind of in the corner, so I kind of saw her run, and I was pointing and yelling. When he saw us, he had, he, he had a giant smile on his face. He, he was smiling, high-fiving. Mahomes took off his headband and placed it in Brody's hand. It was really then. <laughs> priceless pure joy ensued. It was his first game. I couldn't be happier for him. Videos of the boys' genuine joy had fans hitting their like and share buttons all over social media. Brody's video. Me? I saw it a thousand times. <laughs> Still, some classmates took some convincing. As you know, Patrick Mahomes is a huge star, so they were like, what the heck? So awesome. The boys know some diehard adult fans would like to get their hands on this headband. Just because it's his first playoff game and win, and but then if they win the Super Bowl, then it could go for a lot more. But it's not for sale. Nope. It's a memory <laughs> they're holding on to. One Brody originally put in his pocket. When we went to church the next morning, he was looking through his pocket. He couldn't find it. I was like, did you lose it? He was like, no, it's right here. <laughs> Brody was kind enough to let us hold it, but says he has big plans for the Mahomes headband. He wants to place it safely inside of a shadow box. Reporting from North Kansas City, Emily Rittman, KCTV5 News. Yeah, you have to protect that thing. That's big stuff. Even though Sunday.